it's Scott Simmons of the ArtBeatRadioShow.com, and it's nighttime on Salt Spring. It's dark. It's in the winter, and I'm with Lauren Chance. How are you tonight, Lauren? I'm great, thank you. So you're having a big opening tonight here on Salt Spring. This is my first big opening art show. Yeah. Well, you've been an artist for quite a while now, haven't you, Lauren? I've been an artist, yeah, for a long, long time. <laughs> Longer than we want to talk about. It. <laughs> well, I've seen your paintings in so many houses on Salt Spring and around, especially the sailboats. How many sailboats have, do you think you've painted? Oh, gosh. I've sent yacht portraits all over the world. So I've done a ton of them. I've got books full of pa- pictures of uh, boats I've painted for people. Do you think that's probably the genre that you're most known for? Is the It's the one I love to do most, is yachts. Uh, I like the I like them to be definite and and uh, it, you know I like them to have the detail that the owner will recognize. A lot of times you have the spinnakers up too, like the really uh, shots of action shots on the boat. Yep, for sure. Yeah. They send you in a photo, is that what they do? Or? Oh, yeah. yeah. I've had people send me photos of their boat sitting on a trailer and said, would you put this in Quad Sea Bay? <laughs> and uh, I could, I was able to do it. So <laughs> A little bit of uh, uh, a little bit of artistic creation. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So this is your first, and you've been painting for years, and this is your first big show, though. First big show here. I've been a member for just a little over a year, and this is my first big show here, then. I have probably seen your paintings in at least a hundred homes over the years. I mean, they're, people love your shots. I mean, it's because they're detailed, accurate of the boats. I mean, that, I think that's why people really like it. Is I think so. Yeah, I think that's what they like, and that's what, what I like to do also. It's and you're a sailor, so that you you like to get the the right detail of the boat, not like stick an extra mast on it or something. That helps <laughs> a lot. When you know a little bit about boats, you know how the rigging goes and so on, and yeah. it makes it a little bit more uh, uh, vivid, I guess, or defined, I guess is the word. And you've also got some pictures of around, uh, paintings from around town too, don't you? Oh yes, yeah, yeah, several. But usually you're not around town in the summer, are you? Uh, we sail on our, our boat for about three months every summer. So we go north normally, and that's where I get most of my inspiration for my painting. I love the West Coast, and I love the West Coast feel, and I try to incorporate that into my paintings. And, and your boat's a unique sailboat too, isn't it? It's uh, it's like an all-weather sailboat that you can use in rough, rainy weather and stay dry. It's kind of a really unique boat, isn't it? It is. It's a Danish motor sailor. 27 feet and it's been in our family for 29 years now and we bought it brand new oh, so yeah yeah no it's have, is there any other ones around the coast like that uh, there's one other i believe and that's the only one i've seen but there was 1535 of that model built but they're all in europe oh, okay. and it's a very good uh, all-weather boat isn't it it is and the danish workmanship was what impressed us most about it that was great so what do you see new for your art coming up this year? More commissions? or? Uh, well, I hope. I just finished two commissions uh, in the last month or so. One went to California and one went to Washington. So that uh, made me feel good. It didn't waste my summer. <laughs> so a lot of people see you up cruising yeah, in the cruising. Yeah, we talk about it. And I show people my book that I have that's with all my artwork in it. And do you have a website too or no? Uh, no, I don't. The only website I have is the one here that, that the gallery has. Yeah. And, uh, but your paintings are well known, aren't they? Oh, they are. Yeah. It's like a niche market, the sailboat paintings. Yes, yes. It's going to be your legacy that will live on forever. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> my great-grandson is here today and my wife was telling me he'll probably inherit some of them. <laughs> but you know, for some people that have a certain boat, they're just, you know, like they're sitting in their office behind it like that's their pride and joy i mean it really is oh, for sure yeah and to have a painting of their pride and joy is really something isn't it oh, hey that's for sure yeah. well thank you very much for the article lauren and uh, i'm glad to see you have a big show and a big turnout in the winter time on november and salt spring and uh, a lot of people here are appreciating your artwork thanks god thanks very much thanks